What's going on, guys? Your boy Gamer Guy now here. Bring you guys some Madden 16 Ultimate Team. This is a 50k wage I play against my dude. I'm turning. Um, this was on my live stream. If you guys don't know about my live stream, you guys definitely go check that video. Well, check out my link in the description below for my live streams, man. This I'll be doing all my wages and I'll repost my wages here on YouTube for you guys to see how the wages go down. They're both Falcons fans. Um, I believe this is his team on the left. That's my team on the right. He got a Saints player on the team. Ew, disgusting, man. Um, Max Ogre is definitely wasn't even worth the trade. Trading him away for Jimmy Graham was such a such a pitiful thing for the Saints. But who am I to blame? My team sucks. We play Jags on Sunday. You know, go Falcons. Hope for the best. Anywho, to this game we go. Here we see ball first. So we're coming out on defense against this dude. Um, look at my man Deshaun Jackson. Um, Action Jackson taking off to the 26 yard line, man. So right here, he hit up a screen pass. Uh, I believe that Devontae Freeman. He had Devontae Freeman as well. We both actually we both had Devontae Freeman. Why come I? I come out thought it was Todd Gurley. Well, I was okay. That's why I thought it was Todd Gurley. He had two backs. Okay, he had a one-two, a nice combination punch, a one-two punch with Devontae and Todd Gurley. That thing, it was it was a nice combination punch. Oh what not? So first thing right here, he ran up a pitch play to uh, Todd Gurley. He is killing. Me. He was killing me with the run game early in the game. I mean, you can see he's got mixing it up. But, you know, like I said, man, we got to run. Well, look, like I didn't say, we got a couple of little cute little heaters, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Get the sack, we first into a field goal, he ended up missing it. Once on, when the ball lock, I kind of, you know, catch on to, like, where do they run the ball to? Unless you got, like, all night now linemen, I just can't stop you from pancaking my D linemen um, or whatnot. So, right here, we throw a dot right there to outshine. Get the first down, moving the chain. Try to hurry up and score before half here. Just check it down to Amari Cooper. Get down. Because, hey, he might have an annual overall team, but them head stakes, them, they, the thing is still ferocious, man. We ran the read off with Teddy Bridgewater right here. Get a nice first down. Move the chain to a two minute warning. Moving on down. We're looking, we're looking, we hit up. Who else? Amari Cooper stay in bounds. And we get a touchdown. And that rhymes. We spend bars out here, man. We dropping bars on the live call. Not the live call, but the. Post commentary. What am I talking about? I'm drunk today. Um, hold on. Let's take a little bit of this high seat. Man, y'all gotta get y'all some of that high seat from McDonald's. I think it's too good, man. So right here, he dot me up. Like, look at that separation. Is that Roddy White? Is that old Roddy White, man. Like Roddy White in the Falcons jersey. Right here, man. I don't know what the hell. Um, number 55 was doing right there, and Sean Smith so damn slow. I don't know what I, I don't know what was number 55 doing on that play, but he should have played that. Like he didn't play it at all. So third and 16, he looking for someone to get up. He throws an absolute dart right in the soft zone. That defense, man, that was nice patience by him getting that ball off. By the way, we both had Teddy Bridgewater. You guys didn't notice. It's not against title. 47 seconds left for half. Uh, I'm. Aim for a field goal. Aim for a field goal at best. Try it. We just come out of just hole chucking for the one time. And Amari Cooper comes down with a nice spec catch. I don't like hole chucking my opponents, man. Because unless they start hole chucking me first. But sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do when the coins are on the line. And you repeat, you you hear me clearly? When they're on the line, you gotta do what you gotta do, man. So right here, we're looking, we're looking, and we just get sacked, man. I got I had X open early in the play, but I don't even look into the left side of the field. I'll just stand down the middle side of the field. Right here, we throw a dot and bridge one over throws about a freaking mile. Yo, all about y'all, but do like do y'all feel like when y'all play games, y'all quarterback just try to screw y'all over like the most? Like, man, I could have a touchdown, beat up seven, 14 to 7, set them up 10 to 7. At least I get ball back out of half. But this is like I don't know, man. Like, Bridgewater, man, he's been scoring up lately. I'm thinking about selling him, honestly. He's been scoring up too much. So, right here, since Bridgewater was struggling, man, with the overthrow, it's how, you know, mixing it with the run game a little bit more. So, we go back to the pass game, and Bridgewater throws a dot. That's all I want for you, Bridgewater. I don't want you overthrowing pass. I want you to throw absolute beautiful dots for me. And right there, that was really pass interference, low key. If you, guys, you guys can replay see the pass interference. Third and eight, we got, we got, we got, we got my man Stephon Diggs open, and he overthrows it. This bomb Bridgewater overthrows this wide open street. I mean, this wide open post going across the middle. Like, how the hell do you overthrow that? It's many times I overthrow that. He can just throw, he can just throw slants over the middle, of those skinny little post routes, and he can get it right. <clears throat> so his Bridgewater can throw better than mine. And right there, Julio Jones just abusing Josh Norman right there in that curl route, which I like to see. So I won that match. And then I blew my coverage right there and let the tight end open. Thank God we're tackling though. So right here, game's winding down, man. He got to get a, a field goal to tie the game or a touchdown to take the lead. And we got to lock up, man. We got to lock up. We got to lock up. So third and three. I bait him right into the slant route. He throws it right 
in my hands, and we take it to the house for six, man. And no time, girl, don't you catch me, man. This fat ass need to hurry, but keep going. Go all the way to the house, and we get the nice pick six. That thing was huge, man. I got that. It was a sign of relief. Uh, I seen two slants coming over the middle. So I was like, man, I got to take a gamble. I got to take one of these slants. I got to jump one of them, man. So I decided to take the one on the right. Because Julio Jones was the star receiver. I decided to go towards that direction more than the other receiver he wanted to hit. Because it kind of might have been Matt Ryan just forcing the Julio. Right here, Josh Norman comes up with the pick. Double coverage. And that'll be the end of the game, guys. We do end up winning. Getting our 50K. Good game to my man. I'm turning. If you guys want to play him, definitely add him. Definitely legit play as well. He paid up before the game as well. Um, checking out the stats here with my bridge well compared to his. So all that, man. It's your boy Gamer Guy 9. I'm signing off. Peace.